Nobody had heard of any of this until about March 2020, when Dylan Mulvaney decided that he was actually a woman. Now he has about 8 million followers on TikTok, was featured by Forbes at their Power Women's Summit, and has a series of contracts with makeup companies, including ad deals with Cerave, Mac, Neutrogena, and Kate Spade. That's right, men are so unbelievable at being women that one can say he is a woman and become one of the most influential women in America in just six months of wearing dresses and ironing his hair. The patriarchy always wins, gang. Person, this fellow Mulvaney. He began to document his attempt to become a woman in a series that he dubbed Days of Girlhood. Day one featured Mulvaney explaining that he had cried three times, had told someone he was fine when he wasn't, and had ordered clothes that had cost too much money. All, mar all hallmarks of being a girl, according to him. It's not sexist at all if he says it. That's just what being a woman is, right? Crying too much and fibbing your friends and spending too much money on clothes. That's, that's what women do. See, if I say that, that's an ugly stereotype about women. But if I say I'm a woman, then I have the authority to speak about these ugly stereotypes and pretend that they actually apply.